السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته النهارده هنتكلم على البنكرياس ذا بنكرياس از ذا وان اوف ذا موست امبورتنت اكسسوري جلاندز ان ذا جي اي تي ات كان كومبليت ذا ديجيشن سيبريتلي اف وي هاف ا لوك اباوت ذا بنكرياس وي ويل سي هير ات از اكسوكراين اند اندوكراين جلاند اندوكراين بورشن اوف ذا بنكرياس It is the islets of Langerhans cells, which secrete the insulin and the glucagon directly to the blood. So it is endocrine. Exocrine gland secreting uh, in the duct, the secretion, two secretions, acinar cells from acinar cells and from uh, ductal cells. The acinar cells secreting the pancreatic enzyme and the, the ductal cells secreting the aqueous in it in a hco3 sodium bicarbonate solution from the uh, ductal cells both exocrine portion of the pancreas will be secreted directly to the duodenum if we look at The pancreatic secretion, the volume is 1.122 uh, liters per day. Uh, about the pH, it is the highest pH, it is 8 alkaline, and the most alkaline secretion in the body. As we said before, the most acidic secretion, the stomach secretion, the most alkaline secretion. The pancreatic secretion. The composition, aqueous, alkaline secretion, enzymes. The aqueous alkaline secretion secreted by the ductal cells rich in HCO3. Its role to neutralize the acidic chyme in the duodenum. Subdivided into uh, the function. to protect the duodenal mucosa and it increase the efficiency of the pancreatic enzymes. The pancreatic enzymes actively secreted by acinar cells, three of them, proteolytic enzyme, which digest the protein, pancreatic amylase, which digest the carbohydrates, pancreatic lipase, which they uh, digest the fat. The pancreatic proteolytic enzyme secreted in, in active form and then activated in the duodenal lumen. In the pancreas, it is secreted inactively, in active form, and then in the duodenum Uh, start to be active or activated in the duodenum. From the duodenal secretion, activating uh, the trypsinogen to trypsin by enterokinase. Then the trypsin will activate the chemotrypsin. Chemotrypsin, uh, chemotrypsinogen is to be activated to chemotrypsin, and then the uh, bro carboxy peptidase, it is in active form as well to be activated by the trypsin to be active carboxy peptidase. This is for the protein digestion. For the fat digestion, We have the triglyceride by the lipase will uh, be end of the day will be like monoglyceride and free fatty acids. Pancreatic lipase is only enzyme that can digest fat. This is very important information. The pancreatic lipase is the only enzyme that can digest fat. Pancreatic lipase and amylase are secreted in their active form. The amylase or lipase 
secreted in active form. Protection of the pancreas from autodigestion the, through the proteolytic enzyme remain inactive until they reach the duodenum. Now, if the, these enzymes, or now the enzymes D, go well, the pancreas, can it in the active data, على طول هتعمل digestion لي هتعمل auto digestion of the pancreas. لكن ربنا سبحانه وتعالى خلق لنا الانزيمز دي تبقى ان اكتف وبعدين ترانسميتد للديودينم ستارت تو بي اكتف عشان تعمل الدور بتاعها في البروتين ديجيشن فهنا عندنا البروتيوليتيك انزيمز ريمين ان اكتف until they reach the duodenum. Then in the duodenum, the duodenum secreting the enterokinase, اللي هو هيعمل activation للإنزيمز لي ال A to to be in في الحالة أو to be in its active form. The pancreas secreted trypsin inhibitor. وبعد inhibit the trypsin. Trypsin is responsible for activation of all enzymes. يعني اللي نحنا شوفنا في the slides تقريبا رقم ثلاثة أو أربعة have seen before in the in the previous slides that the trypsin responsible about activation of other enzymes. But the trypsin itself will be inhibited by the pancreas by trypsin inhibitor. وبالتالي will stay in, uh, in, in active form till it, be, it will be activated in the duodenum. Deficiency in the pancreatic enzymes, some diseases like deficiency or leading to decrease in the pancreatic enzymes will, be, will affect the digestion of fat. Will lesser effect on protein and carbohydrate digestion. هنا التأثير الأكثر the most uh, serious effect is the pancreatic enzymes decreased will affect the fat digestion more than uh, the effect on the carbohydrate digestion. If we have like blockage of the pancreatic duct due, due to any diseases, the pancreatic lipase will be decreased. Pancreatic lipase decrease will lead to failure of fat digestion. Failure in fat digestion leading to steatorrhea. Steatorrhea is uh, one of the uh, diseases excessive undigested fat in feces. 60 to 70% uh, of the indigested fat leading to uh, steatorrhea, slag diarrhea, but the most content of the, uh, uh, the feces will be fat from 60 to 70% of the indigested, indigested fat. Decreased pancreatic lipase, failure of the fat digestion and absorption, failure in the absorption of fat soluble vitamins, uh, deficiency in vitamin D, leading to decreased intestinal calcium absorption, decreased blood calcium. Decreased blood calcium will decrease the bone, the calcium in the bone, decrease the bone density. As well, vitamin K deficiency will lead to decreased clotting factors, leading to bleeding tendency. How to control the pancreatic secretion by hormonal and the neural, but primarily hormonal. If we are controlling by hormonal and the neural, but mainly and primarily hormonal. Hormonal control of the pancreatic secretion because of the upper small intestine secrete two hormones, secretin and cholecystokinin. Both hormones secreted due to stimulation of the cells of the duodenum or upper part of the small intestine 
will leading to increased secretion of secretin and the cholecystokine. The acid will activate or uh, leading to secretion of the secretin and the fat will stimulate the secretion of cholecystokine. As we know, the chyme going out from the stomach, including fat, including protein, partially digested protein, fat, uh, carbohydrates, partially digested carbohydrates, with the gastric uh, juice, which is acidic, when the acid of the chyme touching the duodenal surface, leading to secretin secretion. And the presence of fat in the chyme will stimulate the cholecystokine. What is the role of the secretin? The secretin uh, secreted due to presence of acid in the duodenal lumen increases secretin and secretin going to the blood and uh, through the circulation, go to the pancreatic duct cells, leading to aqueous secretion. So what is responsible about the aqueous secretion of the uh, pancreas from the ductal cell it is a secretin. It's rule to neutralizing the acidity in the lumen to make very good media for digestion by neutralization. As we said before, the pH is eight and the, the acidity of the stomach like two, for example. So needing for this highly, highly alkaline secretion coming from the, and aquas as well, watery, from the uh, pancreas to neutralizing the uh, uh, food or the chyme coming out from the stomach. Then the uh, role of the cholecystokine about the fat responsible for fat, uh, stimulated by fat and the protein in the duodenum, leading to increase the cholecystokine secretion going to the blood, affecting the acinar cells of the pancreas, leading to secretion of pancreatic enzymes. Pancreatic enzymes, as we said before, will be responsible about the digestion of protein and a carbohydrates and fat. Acid in the lumen, leading to secretin, secretion from the duodenum, secretin carried by the blood, pancreatic duct, increase the aqueous secretion. Fat and the protein in the lumen, will leading to CCK release, CCK carried by the blood, pancreatic acinar cells, pancreatic enzymes in the lumen to digest protein and fat, here to neutralize and the acid from CCK from affecting the acinar cells, secretin affecting the pancreatic ductal cells. Neural control of the pancreatic secretion, conditioned reflex or unconditioned reflex through the vagus nerve, through the vagus nerve, with salivary secretion, gastric secretion, and the pancreatic secretion, and the liver secretion. This is the main neural control of the pancreatic, and it is one of the most important uh, uh, control of the whole secretions from the GIT, salivary, gastric, pancreatic, liver, through the conditioned reflex and unconditioned reflex. Conditioned reflex, as we said before, thinking, smelling, uh, touching food uh, and the, the unconditioned reflex, it is fact of presence of food in the mouth and by chewing or mastication. 
neural control of pancreatic secretion thinking of the food or food in the mouth leading to uh, through the vagus nerve increasing pancreatic acinar cells moderate increase in the pancreatic enzymes if we cut this vagus nerve little effect on the pancreatic secretion Control pancreatic secretion by neural, hormonal, neural by cephalic phase 20%, gastric phase 10%, increase a moderate increase in the enzyme secretion through the vagus. Intestinal or hormonal, intestinal hormones 70%. CCK and security market increase in the enzymes, market increase in the aqueous secretion HCO3. So we have this diagram of uh, showing us the pancreatic secretion control. Thank you very much. See you soon in another lecture.